Hello and welcome back to the channel. I'm really glad to have you here. Today's video is part of the Frankincense mini series that we've started talking about the benefits of Frankincense as well as its users, some warning signs, and we've also just started a little mini series in between that, uh, handling a couple of elements and problems that Frankincense has been proven and known to help with. And we also talk about the scientific research as well as give you some dosage recommendations. So then in the end, you can actually decide and make an informed decision whether to use frankincense as part of your treatment plan or not. I'm not a medical professional so it's a really good idea whenever you're undertaking any sorts of herbs or oils as part of your treatment plan to consult your own doctor because each condition is different. You might have specific ailments that might contradict and uh, frankincense might be harmful for instance. I'll include the playlist of frankincense so then you, if you're interested you can watch the whole videos relating to that and I'll also put in the link uh, directly to the products that I've been using for the last eight years really good quality products if you want to use them they're available in both iHerb Amazon and eBay so now we're going to talk about how frankincense can reduce arthritis. Frankincense has anti-inflammatory effects that may help reduce joint inflammation caused by osteoarthritis and rheumatoid arthritis. Researchers believe that frankincense can prevent the release of leukotrienes, which are compounds that cause inflammation. Terpenes and boswellic acids appear to be the strongest anti-inflammatory compounds in frankincense. Tube and animal studies note that boswellic acids may be as effective as non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs with fewer negative side effects according to studies. I'll also put the studies as well as some other resources you might be interested in in the description box below so you please do check that out. So in one recent review frankincense was consistently more effective than a placebo at reducing pain and improving mobility. In one study participants given one gram per day of frankincense extract for eight weeks reported less joint swelling and pain than those given a placebo. They also had a better range of movement and were able to walk further than those in the placebo group. In another study, Boswella helped reduce morning stiffness and the amount of um, anti-inflammatory medication given to people who had rheumatoid arthritis. That said, not all studies agree and more research is needed. So as a summary from Healthline, uh, frankincense's anti-inflammatory effects may help reduce symptoms of osteoarthritis and rheumatoid arthritis. However, more high quality studies are needed to confirm these effects. I remember about two years ago I was suffering from a terrible joint pain and some swelling around the legs and the arms as well so when I went to the doctor unfortunately they had no idea did all the tests everything was clear and then I decided to give frankincense capsules a try and it was awesome amazing it worked within the first week less joint uh, pain less swelling and just I was able to wash the dishes I was able to exercise and move freely and another thing that I've also tried, if you do not have access to frankincense, you could also use capsules that have the active ingredient on turmeric, which is curcumin, as well as um, ginger and black pepper. So capsules that have ginger, black pepper and turmeric. Absolutely amazing. Um, the recommended dosage for those suffering from osteoarthritis based on the studies that were done to the actual dosage that were found to be more effective for osteoarthritis 200 megagrams of frankincense capsule three times per day as for people suffering from rheumatoid arthritis it is suggested for best results to consume um, 200 to 400 megagrams of frankincense three times per day i hope you found this video helpful do give us a thumbs up subscribe to the channel we'd love to have you on board take care and have a great day bye bye